love living by the sea. One day this summer, uh, I went for a swim in the sea. I live by the sea and it's one of those wonderful privileges that you get. You can just go in the sea and have a swim. And I swam out this day and the sea was astonishing. And it was an absolutely perfect day and I swam out after all and I felt just really elated. But then I became aware that the sea around me was really calm. And it felt like there was incredible surface tension in the surface of the sea which surrounded me. It was one of those moments when you, you look around and you think, oh, this is so significant. It felt um, really uh, powerful. I felt really aware of all the natural forces that were um, acting on that surface. The piece I've made, Heave, it's a series of slices through the surface and each one is slightly different and it, so it appears to twist. I use this material, fibreglass matting, which is impregnated with a resin that reacts to ultraviolet light. You basically expose it to sunlight. So uh, I, I use the beach as my mould, if you like. So I literally dug um, grooves in the sand and used that to lie the fibreglass into. But then you finish off the curing process by lying it into the sand. And I love how the sand sticks to the resin and it kind of bears traces. One of the elements which is new to me about this project was working on the beach. It's an encompassing experience and uh, so to be on the shore creating this work in response to the sea which I was standing right next to, um, yeah, it, it really fueled the project and it just felt perfect. It really challenges me because it's all oh it's all about process and it's not so much about glass this time um, and that is a real leap in my practice to be so focused on process.